Three botches you probably missed at WWE Hell in a Cell 2020. There were a number of botches last night at Hell in a Cell. The Hell in a Cell environment always opens up the possibility of botches. How are you guys? Hope you all are well. Friends people are calling it botchamania. But it was hell of interesting and entertaining. We all love WWE Hell in a Cell 2020. I think it was the most hyped PPV of year till now. Now these mistakes are ignorable, don't take me wrong. It's just for fun that I am pointing out these botches. I will link original videos on the cards of the video, because WWE is so strict. And you can help one human being today, it's me, subscribe my channel. It will take some seconds for you and really, it's live saving for me. Hell in a Cell took over the Amway Center in Orlando, Florida, last night, as part of a brutal night of wrestling entertainment. Both Sasha Banks and Randy Orton reached massive milestones in their careers with their respective victories, while The Miz became a two-time Mr. Money in the Bank. While it was a night where WWE focused on quality over quantity, there were still a few moments where several stars were left blushing. The unpredictable environment of Hell in a Cell opens up more chances of botches, and last night, there were a few stars who fell victim to the new environment. Here are just three botches you probably missed from last night's Hell in a Cell event. Number 3. Jey Uso vs. The Strap. Jey Uso came up short in his I Quit match inside Hell in a Cell against Roman Reigns when the Tribal Chief used Jimmy Uso against Jey. The former tag team champion didn't stand a chance against Reigns, but there was one point in the match where the momentum swayed into Jey's favor. The former champion found a strap under the ring, and after using it on Roman Reigns numerous times, he decided to wrap it around his neck and try to choke him out. The issue here was that Jay struggled to wrap the strap around Roman's head. Luckily, the last time, the strap remained in place, and Jay was able to continue the move he had planned. Number 2. Bailey learns not to tape kendo sticks. Bailey made her debut inside Hell in a Cell, and it wasn't one that the SmackDown Women's Champion would have wanted. Not only did Bailey lose her championship to her former best friend, but she also found out the hard way that things inside the cell don't always go to plan. Midway through the match, Bailey attempted to tape together two kendo sticks to put across Hell in a Cell, but at first, the champion struggled with the tape and even asked the referee for help. Things got even worse when the tape didn't hold the two sticks together, and Bailey was forced to completely abandon the plan and was heard audibly shouting, Dang it! Number 1. Roman Reigns vs. The Steel Steps at Hell in a Cell. The steel steps were perhaps the most used object inside Hell in a Cell last night, as Roman Reigns took advantage of their weight and used them against Jey Uso. The Universal Champion only began to have issues when officials headed to the ring, and he had to throw the steps in to show he was annoyed. Reigns tried to throw the steps over the top rope, but he was lucky that they bounced the opposite way and not back at him, since they fell to the floor. Reigns did manage to get the steps into the ring at the end, but it was a funny moment when it was supposed to be a tense situation between the tribal chief and his cousin. You can watch these botches in cards above. I will also try to put links in comments. So friends this is the video for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. I will catch you in the next one. Subscribe the channel. Till then watch these videos from my channel. Peace out.